Hello, it's How To Not To and in today's video I will be explaining what all the wash cycles are on the hot point wash machine. So this is the um, RPD 9467JKK model. It has up to 14 different wash cycles and lots of other functions you can use. So let's start off with cycle one which is the daily mix wash and dry and it's currently set at 40 degrees i think the maximum maximum spin on this wash machine is 1400 and as you can see there it's going to take over four hours to wash and dry my clothes and that is quite a long time isn't it so so this wash machine allows you to increase or decrease the uh, temperature probably worth it if you can't wait for your clothes to dry or if you don't have um, anywhere to hang them spin speed is an important consideration as a faster spin speed could reduce drying time typically they range from 1200 to um, 1600 rpm that's revolution per minute if you don't own a tumble dryer or have limited outdoor space to dry your laundry it is sometimes worth running your clean wash on a extra spin and drain cycle to help remove as much water as possible from the laundry as it will help reduce the drying time cycle two is the shirts wash and dry the spin rate has increased for this cycle and will take half the time at the same temperature i have used the hot point washing machine to wash white shirts before on this cycle and it did do a great job at getting all the stains out of the collars and cuffs so um, it left them nice and clean there is also a, a function to remove creases, so that's even better, especially someone like me who hates ironing. Cycle three, uh, talk of the devil, we have the pre-iron with a, a lovely symbol of an iron in the corner there. Will only take 20 minutes to do that. So why spend all that time ironing when you can get the washing machine to do it for you? <sighs> Brilliant. Unless, of course, you enjoy ironing. I knew someone who loved ironing. Never quite understood why. So, I mean, let me know if you like ironing or hate it like I do. <laughs> Please leave a comment below and let me know. Another rhyme. Cycle four, steam refresh. Again, will only take 20 minutes to steam refresh your laundry. Uh, I've never actually used this uh, cycle before, so I'm not sure how great that is. Uh, it will care and protect your laundry, keeping it fresh and perfectly clean. Steam is injected directly into the drum at the end of the washing cycle. It will remove 99% of most common bacteria. We're now moving on to cycle five, which is the anti-stain turbo 45 this cycle is a stain removal capacity even at 20 celsius in 45 minutes the temperature of this cycle can be increased to 40 degrees Cycle 6, uh, Anti-Stain Power 20. This program ensures stain removal capacity. So this is a dedicated anti-stain program that easily uh, removes stains from your clothes without the need for a pre-treatment. Okay, Cycle 7 is the Cotton Cycle. Oh, well, well, well. I was wrong by saying it was 1,400. So on the cotton wash cycle, the spin speed goes up to 1,600 and the temperature can be increased to 60 degrees. Cycle eight, eco cycle. By choosing the eco cycle, the wash machine will use lower wash and rinse temperatures. So it will use up less energy. Cycle nine, and this is the most common cycle. It's a synthetics, the maximum temperature. Temperature is 40 degrees, so it won't damage uh, my clothes that are not cotton. And it's ideal to wash all types of materials. So that's cotton, polyester, etc. So it's an all round cycle. Cycle 10 is a multicolour, so as the picture illustrates, you can wash different colours together without fading them out, and the colour will not leach onto the other clothes. 
Cycle 11, ultra delicate, use this program to wash very delicate garments, having stresses or sequins. I would recommend turning the garments inside out before washing them and placing small items into a special bag for washing delicates and use liquid detergent on a delicate garment. Okay, the cycle 12, which is wool. So if you have clothes with the wool mark label, use the wool wash cycle. And you can also wash um, clothes that have the hand wash label on, on it as well, provided that the products are washed according to the instructions on, on the garment. Okay, cycle 13, almost finished. This cycle is sport, ideal for clothes that are sweaty but not heavily soiled. So the wash machine runs a short wash and rinse cycle and the temperature is also lower to prevent creases in a typically synthetic garment. Cycle 14, now can you remember what the cycle 14 was? This is a memory tester, a little game for you to play. I will give you the answer at the end of this video, so stick around to find out if you were right on what cycle 14 is. Does anyone fancy a drink? I do. So I'm just going to go away and back. Multi-rinse, a press to select desired rinse type. That's all I have to say on that one. <laughs> Spin button, it spins one way when the washer is running a wash cycle and recirculating the water. And it spins the other way, whoa, when this washer is doing a spin cycle. Okay, I'm now just going to wash a load using the surf powder. This is the tropical lily and I always wondered how much to use with each load. Well, it tells you exactly how much to use on the back of the box. And the cycle I'm going to choose is, yes, you've guessed it, the same cycle, <laughs> most common cycle that I use anyway. So this is a quick run through of all the cycles until we get to number nine, which is the um, which is the synthetics at 40 degrees with a 1000 uh, spin speed, which I don't mind that as I'm going to hang these out in the garden to fully dry. And it will take approximately one hour, 55 minutes. That's just under two hours. The symbol on the top left indicates the washing machine is filling up with water. I only just noticed that. <laughs> um, so that's what that does. It cleans the machine. On the display screen, once the desired wash cycle has been selected and has begun, the indicator lights switch on one by one to indicate which phase the cycle is currently in progress. And I have just read that straight out of the manual. So we have wash, rinse, spin, pump, out, end of wash cycle. Um, while that is washing, just going to clean the outside of the wash machine. I should really do this while it's off, but... Um, I've got the charred lock on, so it should be okay to do that. Okay. And the answer to the question, what is this cycle 14? Well, it is the fast wash. Now, can you say that quickly? Fast wash, fast wash, fast wash, fast wash, fast wash. So another wash machine video complete for you guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, like always, please subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching. Bye for now. Fash wash, fash wash, fash wash, wash, fash wash, wash. Fast wash, fast wash, fast wash, wash, wash.